Hi, Will from Floats in the Forest here. I'm here to give you a top tip for when you come to float. When you come to float, you need to have a shower right before you float and a shower after you float. The shower before is not just about when you last had a wash. It's important that you remove any perfumes, lotions, oils and other products from your body and your hair in order to protect the water in the pod. That's the practical reason, but it's also an opportunity for you to mark the transition from the everyday world into the world of your float. You could use the physical process of showering as a mental preparation for the float, maybe by thinking of it as washing away any concerns or cares, or perhaps as dissolving the muscular tensions that we might wear as armour to protect ourselves in the outside world, and which we don't need when we're floating alone in peace and quiet. Of course, it can simply be a pleasure to enjoy the sensation of that warm rain gently cleaning the body, but don't stay in too long and miss out on the time that you could be floating.